Hey everybody, this is Winter Party Outfits, Pinterest inspired with things I already own. Um, this is Emily on Fashion welcoming you. This is the first one. It is the probably one of the more distant ones from what the actual pin was, but I say if you have a velvet dress, take that velvet dress, put on some tights and some cool silver shoes or any other cool high heels and add a cute little purse. Today I very much wished I had a silver purse to match the silver shoes, but I did not, so it didn't really matter. I took a light colored purse and if I were really taking this out, I would throw on a coat. So this second one has a coat. It has, I have a faux fur coat that looks like the one in the picture. <clears throat> I paired it with a black shirt with a high neckline, um, like tucked that shirt up and then a, a very short, very short black mini skirt. Hers has some texture, mine doesn't. I think that's okay. A cute little purse that you hold in your hand and some um, patent leather high heels kind of sealed the deal on this. I think when you have such a big statement coat, it's the outfit. And so you can really do something very basic underneath. Um, and you can see, if you wanna see the original photo, you can go back to the picture before. And like on this one, you can see, I tried to attribute the source where possible. I think who, what, where is a great source to look for. And they said, you know, a dark floral with a cool neckline. So I said, I have a dark floral with a cool neckline. Is it your traditional holiday color palette? Absolutely not, but I truly don't care. I love this neckline so much. This is a Betsy Johnson dress, and so I paired it with tights and shiny black heels and a cute little purse. I would throw a wool coat over this and go to any uh, New Year's party or a thing I'm thinking of doing this winter is a theater show. Um, go to the local theater. So this is another one. If you have a leftover skirt from the Beyonce Renaissance tour or just because you are a fan of Beyonce, you can take that, pa pair it with a black long sleeve. In this case, I chose a sweater. I needed um, skin colored tights here and I couldn't find any, so I just went without, but I would highly recommend if you're doing this for winter, you wear tights and then boots and that's pretty dang warm. I also tucked the hem of this skirt up to make it a little bit shorter and I paired it with this cute white purse again. I just think, again, when you have your statement item like that, like that sparkly skirt or the big fur coat, you can do everything else pretty basic. This girl has the coolest style. She is doing hat, purse, and skirt. I only had the purse and skirt and they don't even match, but they're both red, so there we go. I also have a very different white shirt than hers, but it is mixed media. It's a different texture in the front than the back, so I think that's kind of neat. And then she had it with black boots, so I'm showing you my black boots, and I paired it with my only red purse. I'm very excited to be able to wear this red skirt. I I think it's fun if you have a red skirt, or even you could wear a white blouse over a red dress. And this is a fun holiday outfit, I think. Here's one where you're like imagining you're a winter princess. <laughs> Um, you got the white tights, you got the white skirt, the white top, the big fuzzy coat, the white purse, the white gloves, everything that you can get. And um, most of this is actually cream. Um, the tights and the skirt are white. The shirt and the fur, faux fur are cream. I just kind of was like, they're all in the general realm. Also, this outfit really made me want white boots. I don't have any white boots or white uh, heels yet, but maybe someday I'll get some. For this one, I just went with the silver ones because they, they were kind of like along the lines. Okay, this is one of the more casual options. If you are just like super casual and putting on a skirt is the biggest step, then I say, you know, a skirt. Again, I would do nude colored tights, layer it with some socks, and your, your hottest little heels. These are like plain red shiny heels, but oh my gosh, they just... They just put this outfit on a whole nother level, especially when paired with a red purse. I just think it's so fun. My eye is stuck on the fact that the shirt is cream colored and the sh socks are white. And I'm sorry if your eye is stuck there too. Um, I don't know what to do about it. I need a plain white tee that's long sleeve. I, I have this one and it's close, but it's not exact. And anyway, so, you know, you're just making it work with things you own. That's how you do it. <laughs> Okay, here's another one. I do not have a huge white long coat, but I was gonna use my short little puffer one again. I did have a white dress, so I threw the puffer coat over the high-necked white sweater dress. And I am absolutely not as fine as that woman was. She she was so gorgeous. 
I didn't know what shoes to do, so I just did these plain clear ones. Um, they are kind of easier to walk in, and so um, that was nice. And then I did the chain purse. Um, I wish I had her gorgeous hair or, you know, just in, I don't know, her beautiful long coat, but, you know, a short one works. Okay, this is very little to go on except for polka dot tights, sharp toed, sharp heels. And then I think you can kind of go wild. I took a long dress and I tucked it up. You can see it's tucked there. And um, then I threw a black leather jacket on top for some difference in texture. <clears throat> um, I love this. I like how this type of dress, you can tuck it up like I did. And from far away, you don't even notice it that much. Um, you can wear the jacket open or you can leave it zipped closed, depending on what your weather is like. You could even layer another sweater. Okay, and here's one more. This lady had this beautiful um, burgundy dress. I, I have a much less interesting burgundy dress, but the star of this show is, again, the big long coat. And I ended this whole video, all these ideas with the big long coat, because every idea that came before this, the ones that didn't have coats, you could wear this big long coat. Do you have a big long coat? Throw it over your cute holiday party outfit and go to the theater, go to the ballet, go go to New Year's Eve party, go to something cool, um, make January one to remember, or even the last week of December. I hope you guys are all having a wonderful time and I hope to see you back soon. Um, welcome if you're new and thanks for subscribing. If you are a subscriber, thanks for um, liking, commenting, and subscribing. Thanks for watching. Bye.